Alright guys, welcome to another episode of Long Live the Queen. Last time I got her killed, uh, I, I stupidly rejected a, um, let's see, what was it again? Oh, she, I rejected a duel and she got stabbed. Um, let's see here. I don't know where I'm at in this game. I know I'm right before the thing. But I'm not seeing Lumen as an option here to learn magic. I'm seeing Faith, and I'm not seeing Lumen. So that to me means I must have not gotten into the treasure yet. So we'll, um, I don't know, let's make her learn fighting. What, what was my skill in fighting? Weapons, minus, okay, we'll do, we'll do swords and um, try to get that up. And then um, I'm gonna go for the magic because that's what was uh, failed last time was wielding magic. At least she'll have some kind of fighting chance in a duel. Studying. You take up a wooden sword and practice correct grips and stances. On your journey to Sudbury, this is when we we're attacked by the bandits, and we we're successful. But now she's depressed and afraid. Okay, we've already done the party, so we'll just click through this. I will not be shoved aside. Side with Gwyn Gwynil, and side with her mother. We sided with Gwynil last time. Let's side with her mother. You should listen to your mother. She loves you, and she deserves respect. Thank you, Your Highness. I am the Duchess of Sudbury, and I must c command my um, respect of my own. We're not children anymore, Elodie. If you let people treat you that way, you can't rule them. A bit later, Bernie catches up with you. Oh, this is when she wants to go to the... the pa old palace. Where, like, my Novan history fails. Okay. Wait, I've already done the treasury. Ugh, then why can't I do magic? I don't understand. Have I not talked to... what's her face? Alright. What we're gonna do... <laughs> what I do? what I do? Oh no. I don't know what I did. Alright, we're going... No, let's... Oh, duh. Alright, we're going to load the game again. We're gonna do the same thing we did last time. Not to be repetitive or anything. And we're gonna talk to you, uh, that one chick. Okay, yeah, we just haven't talked to you, um, the Duchess of Ursul. Pick up the crystal with your bad hands, press it against your chest, over your heart, and say illuminate. Do it. Pretty much magical girl moment. Okay, now that we got that out of our way, that's much better. Now we should do lemon. Yes! Let's wield magic. We're going to survive this. Wield magic. You learn to summon a small glowing light, which you can uh, then move around independently. You learn how to cast rays of white light that can banish shadows and blind your opponents. The Duchess of Lila has sent you a gift. What's this? It is a cushion. That's nice, I guess. Foreign Affairs. Let's keep it because I have a feeling that that's the reason why that failed is because it means something special to them. Find a chair or sofa to set it on. Alright. I don't really care about this. I guess treasury. Alright, classes. Keep wielding magic. We're gonna make her survive. Damn it. You learn how to create teeny discs of solid light which can fly through the air and cut into targets. By concentrating, you can create a wave of discontents with, um, which panics and enrages animals in the area. The Duchess of Mead is here to see you, my lady. Hello, Elodie. I'm sorry to trouble you, but have you seen Brawny? Not since the party last week. Oh, this is when she, like, runs off. Oh no, what has she done? I think we should have went to look for her. How is her willful, anyway? It's almost all the way up. Alright, let's just... Let's see. Lumen... So we're almost to 50. 
Don't they... Doesn't it, when it hits 50, they ask you to start doing the other ones? I'm not sure. Alright, let's do classes. I guess we'll find out. You learn to create a blade of solid light, which you can wield like a sword, slice through flesh and stone alike. Okay, yeah. Studying. That one didn't make it go up. That's sad. I wasted that one. As you walk through the castle, a giant and a great gust of wind suddenly blows out all the candles. How strange. That there must have been an open window somewhere. She's not the brightest. What can I say? My princess is a little on the stupid side. <laughs> Alright. So, now we need to do resist magic and sense magic. You close your eyes and learn to feel the magic inside of you. You increase your awareness of your own thoughts and emotions, making it difficult for mind-affecting magic to twist your reactions. Things have been so unsettled lately. Everyone's on edge. Edge. <laughs> we need something cheerful. You could do. You could hold it. Oh, I'm sorry. You could hold a tournament. Oh, that's okay. This is where she dies. Um, let's do gold. A purse of, a purse of gold for the champions. Very well, I will draft the announcements. I'm just gonna pass through this. Suddenly feel very cold in the world. Seems dark. What did I do? What did I do? You worry that perhaps you shouldn't have eaten so much candy and you tried to ignore the feelings. Did I accidentally eat that candy? Unfortunately, it was just, it was more than just an upside um, stomach. By the time you realize you've been poisoned, it's too late. Oh dear god, I killed her again. I didn't even know she was eating the candy. I usually tell her not to. Now I know why I've been telling her not to. Seven minutes into this video and I've already killed her. We had just, we gotten so far. I feel like we had made progress and... <sighs> Alright, Melody. No more eating the candy. Didn't anyone ever teach you not to eat candy for strangers? Alright, let's do weapons. Okay. We've already done this like 50,000 million times. We are at the party now. I'm surprised she's not like more distraught. Like, let's go to the party even though I was just attacked and try to be killed. Apparently the music's still going. Magical girl moment. Okay, let's um, let's do wield and let's do wield. We'll get our wielding all the way up, and then at least now we know. At least we won't be wasting one wield. Uh, keep it. Let's do this because I know willfulness helps women. Wield magic, wield magic. Okay. Briny's missing. Alright, let's do this again. Alright, classes. We'll do one wield magic and then we'll go ahead and do sense magic and start that up. Okay. You close your eyes and feel the magic inside of you. Okay, this time, Elodie, we're not gonna eat the chocolate. Are we on the same page? I hope we're on the same page. How much was the sense magic. Okay, two more should do it, maybe one more. I think it's gonna be one more, so let's do one resist. <sighs> you increase your awareness of your own thoughts and emotions, and you practice using small amounts of magic and feel the power inside of yourself. Okay, we're holding a tournament. Uh, employment. The winners will have the option for, of taking up royal uh, appointments. It's a recruitment drive. Very well, I will draft the announcements. I think I forgot to do that last time. Someone's not watering the plants. My lady, a gift has arrived from Kegel. From the Duke? No, my lady, a merchant house. Chocolates! What? Why would you pop it in your mouth? It didn't even give me an option. Didn't it give me an option last time? Oh god, that's why she died. Okay guys, I am going to pause this video. I am going to get it to where she doesn't die. I can never win with this game. I don't understand why. Okay, let's load.
make sure she doesn't eat the freaking chocolates. What failed? I don't even remember. Am I pausing this game? I don't know. I don't know. Okay. I had dead what? Dead. I have dead. She's dead. Okay, I have done weapons last time. I'm not going to do that this time. We're going to do court manners. Let's look at our skills. Okay. Um, court manners and... What failed? I don't remember. Ugh. Okay, we're just going to do court manners and hope that makes it so that she doesn't eat the chocolate. Because I remember court manners somewhere in that. You study the traditions of ballroom etiquette. You memorize the correct title for every servant in the castle. Oh, I just wasted one. Crap. I hate when I do that. Okay, we're gonna pause this. You guys can- you've seen this like a million and one times already. Alright. Now she has Lumen again. So skills. We're gonna go ahead and do another flattery. And we're gonna go ahead and do some Lumen. Because now I'm going to try to keep her from eating those freaking chocolates. I can never win. Flattery, and let's do some lumen. Let's do wield. You learn that flattery, um, flattering comments have the best impact when kept short. Gushing makes people feel awkward. <laughs> I don't see why. You learn that it's always better to compliment people for their personality and their choices than their physical attributes. Visual elements are the best flatter on a first meeting. They are expected to be noticed right away. If you've spent more time with someone, suddenly complimenting their attire would ring false. I don't know why. Ooh, I've unlocked a new outfit. You learn to summon a small glowing light. Again. Okay, let's keep the thing. Let's go for Willful again. I feel like I'm I'm never gonna keep her alive. I feel like I'm just gonna keep killing her. Um, okay, let's do court manners one more time, and let's go ahead and do lumen again. Manners and wield magic. To directly challenge someone's honor is to clear war. Never make a public ask. Ass. <laughs> Never make a public ass. Never make a public accusation of cowardice, treason, infidelity, or murder unless you are prepared to face mortal enemies. And on that note, you study the etiquette of dueling. Oh, see, I needed this. As a monarch, you are expected to embody the futures of. Uh, the futures? Wow, future. <laughs> honesty, bravery, and generosity. You should always offer aid to those in need, however, you those who. You aid personally are expected to give you their utmost loyalty even unto death. Doth. Okay, yeah, yeah, you learn flair, we got it. Okay, let's let's really try not to eat the chocolates this time, Elodie. That's all I ask. All I ask. Keep doing court manners. Uh, Will and Magic's at 20. I'm not doing this fast enough. I feel like I'm wasting time here. She's gonna die either way. You study the forms of written address, how to issue and decline invitations, how to announce an impending visit, and how to correspond with the rulers of a foreign domain. You study the language of flowers and the secret meanings that can communicate through a gift of a bouquet. You learn <laughs> to create discs. Woohoo! Alright, let's hope she doesn't die this time. Oh no, it's the next one. Alright, I'm gonna assume that she's good. What's her lumen at? Okay, let's do one more lumen. And let's go ahead and start the resist magic. You increase your awareness of your own thoughts and emotions, making it difficult for mind affecting magic to twist your reactions. By concentrating, you can create a white wave of discontent with panics and rage animals in the Adiga. Okay, this is when she does the tournament. Let's do employment. Okay, these is the false flowers, and then this is the chocolates. That's odd. High-handed for some teeny traitor I've never heard of. Save it for later. I don't feel like candy right now. Maybe later. Thank God. Okay, I saved her from one disaster. Now I have another disaster tomorrow. Um, let's go with skills. 
wield magic, resist magic, let's do that again. I hope this is enough. Okay, skills, let's see. I know that 97 <laughs> public manners was enough, so maybe I can tone it down a little bit and then work on this next time if I die again. This is like going to be the most boring episode of me just trying to keep her alive for the stupid duel because she died twice by eating chocolate. You learn to cautious <laughs> cautiously project a magical field through your thoughts, blocking outside magic from touching your mind, but only when you have energy to con um, consciously resist. You learn to create a blade of solid light. This week is the tournament. Um, let's take part in archery. I hope she failed. Didn't she fail the last time? I think so. My family's blood is on your hands. What is he talking about? He casts a metal glove er, on, on the ground with a clatter and raises his sword pointing at you. I challenge you, Elodie, a life for a life. He's challenging you to a duel? Woo, yay. Doesn't he know you could burn him to a crisp by um, just waving your hand? Accept, refuse, kill him with magic. Um, let's accept. Very well, I meet your challenge. As the challenge party, you have a choice of weapons. Swords or staffs. Oh, I did not learn either, or I should have just kill them with magic. Oh gosh, he's gonna die. Ring me my sword! Seems not to realize at first that this is a blend match and not entertainment, or perhaps they do and they are cheering his on the ladder for it. Keevan's rage fills him with great stink, st strength, stink, <laughs> it makes him erratic and unpredictable. Worse, he's armored, and he seems willing to settle for nothing less than your death or his. Oh, you score minor wounds, but his expression never changes, his speed never falters. And his face, his eyes, the red as blood, he's gone berserk. <laughs> he's gone super saiyan. There's nothing you can do <laughs> to stop him, eventually you're overpowered. And I die again. Well, this has been a really crappy episode. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. Um, you know what? I'm going to pause this video, and I'm going to go back, and I'm going to try again, and then I'll let you guys back in, like, uh, right at the duel, now that I know what I'm doing a little bit more. <sighs> okay, I think I got her to the tournament, or at least very close to it, but I did unlock a new outfit. It's a tea dress, isn't it cute? Anyway, um... I already did wield magic. Let's try to do weapons of swords. I don't think she's going to have high enough swords, though, so let's just keep doing magic, I guess. On second thought. And then I'll just kill him, like, right at the beginning. Okay, we've already done this. Tournament. Okay, she failed archery. Let's just, um, do the mounted parade. Choose to leave the parade mounted on a brilliant white horse. However, the effects, uh, the effect of your appearance is spoiled somewhat by the way you were clinging to the horse's neck. Perhaps it might have been wise to take some riding lessons first. Well, it's better than our shooting at archery. All the winners are announced. Blah 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 blah. Someone wants to try to uh, do, um, duel me. Uh, kill him with magic. Without further ado, you direct a full force of magical wrath at the Earl of Lu. Unfortunately, oh no. Your full force amounts to being sprayed, razor-like discs which slice and burn the skin, but nothing more. Against an experienced combatter in armor, there's nowhere near enough. The last thing you hear is the screams of the crowd as the Earl of Lu charges at you. And I died again. I don't think I'm going to save her. Anyway, that was, <laughs> that was the end of this episode. Like if you liked this, press subscribe if you want to see more of my videos. And I will try to get her to survive this duel. I don't know how I'm going to do it yet. I guess I should raise my m magic up a little bit more. I don't know. Because I have to do flattery. <sighs> I wish she wouldn't eat those stupid candies. Anyway, I'll see you guys later. Bye.